I'm John with Smith & Wesson, and what I have here in front of me is the new Smith & Wesson M&P 57, our latest addition to the M&P line. The 57 cartridge has had a 20-year history in the handgun world, but it's been plagued with a lot of issues of cycling and mechanical failures throughout that history. Smith has listened to our consumer market and we've introduced this new handgun that addresses all those problems. We're gonna take you through those features right now. So in the M&P 5.7, we have an exciting new innovation that I'm gonna take you through, our new Tempo Barrel System. The new Tempo Barrel System is actually a two-part barrel system. It's an internal rotary lock system that allows primary extraction only after your projectile passes the gas port area. What that does is it allows for the barrel to stay in a static position long enough to create a fire form effect and let your casing blow out into the chamber correctly and it stays in that position until the bullet passes past the gas port area creating your primary extraction. Okay, we're gonna take you through some of the features of the new 5.7 pistol. First question people always ask, how many rounds in the mag, right? 5.7 pistol, holds a lot of rounds. This is no exception, 22 rounds plus one in the chamber. Moving on to the slide. You do have white dot sights on the front and rear, as well as an optic cut on here. I have a hollow sun mounted on this one right here in front of me. So it is cut for optics. Looking at the end of the muzzle, you may be asking, is this threaded? Yes, it is. We have a half 28 thread on here with a thread cap, keep your threads safe and intact. But those of you that do want to mount a muzzle device or mount a suppressor on here, it is threaded for that. Moving down into the frame area, we do have an internal hammer fired fire control system. So we have that as well as a, flat, a new flat trigger on this gun. Uh, we do have the pick rail on the bottom for any accessories you'd like to mount there. For those of you that are left-handed shooters, this gun is fully ambidextrous and you can interchange your mag release as well to the left hand, right hand side. So if you have lefties and righties, you're good either way. Really enjoyable gun to shoot at the range. On the front of the slide, we do have dual mill cuts on the left hand and right hand side to lighten the slide up and make ease of cycling a little better and more mechanically consistent when you're shooting. And we do have a very slim textured profile on this grip. It's a little slimmer than what you see on some other centerfire pistols, but incredibly comfortable to hold. We're really excited about the new Smith & Wesson M&P 5.7. For any further questions, check out our website.